Today you're going to learn how to create speed ramps in Adobe Premiere Pro. This effect allows you to smoothly transition from normal speed to slow-mo or vice versa. You see this a lot in music videos or skateboard videos especially, but since I don't skateboard, I'm just going to show you how to do this with a glass of water. So without further ado, let's get started. Cineguac. As you can see, I have this super slow-mo clip of me pouring a glass of water, so let's begin by just dragging this right onto the timeline. Let's right-click on the video clip, and then scroll down to Show Clip Keyframes, then go to Time Remapping, and then Speed. And let's just widen this video layer a little bit, and then zoom in so that we have a better look at what we're doing. So you'll see we now have this thin white line right here in the middle of our video clip, this line basically represents the current speed in which the clip is playing. So let's just scrub along and find a point where we want this to begin speed ramping into slow motion. Right before I'm about to pour is a good place to begin. Next, let's click on this Add Remove Keyframe button. And you'll see the moment we press that, a new keyframe will appear right here on our clip. You can also create keyframes by holding down Control on your keyboard, and clicking anywhere on this line. And you'll notice with this clip selected, we can go up to Effect Controls, and right here we have our time remapping keyframes, which we can manipulate here as well. But today we'll be doing pretty much everything here on the timeline. So let's just hover the mouse over a part of the line at the beginning of our clip, where we want to speed up our clip to a normal speed. So if we just click, and then drag this up, you'll see we're now increasing the speed of everything before the keyframe we created. And since this was shot in super slow-mo, we can increase the speed to 450%. You can change this to whatever looks good to you, or depending on the frame rate of your video clip. So now you'll see we have this steep drop-off in speed. And if we play that all back, you'll see we now just have an abrupt transition from normal speed to slow motion. So we're going to go ahead and smooth this transition over a bit. Let's just zoom in here. And let's click on one side of our keyframe, and drag this over however far we want the transition to last. And you'll see the moment we do that, we now have a literal ramp going from 450% to 100%. And if we just grab this little blue thing right on top here, we can twist this around so that the ramp turns into an even smoother curve, giving it that nice smooth Bezier effect. Play that all back, and we have a nice smooth speed ramp. And of course, we can adjust the placement and duration of these keyframes until it looks perfect. And if at any point we want to speed ramp this clip back to normal, we can do the exact same thing, only in reverse. We can create a keyframe right here, increase the speed of the end of our clip, and then drag this keyframe out a few frames or a few seconds, creating another ramp. And let's just give this a nice little curve, and play that all back. It now goes from super slow-mo to normal speed. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, these take a long time to put together, so show me some love, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you next time.